this is where we've been hanging out all morning. And down by the lake. I've been laying on here, re -waxing. Yep, this is our view from the camper. So this is our setup. So this is my grandparents' cabin and then we just brought our camper because um, they don't have enough rooms for everybody who's coming. So we brought our camper, we just set it up here and then there's a fire pit right back behind here and then here's the lake. So this has been a nice cute little setup. Kaya's running in and out. Rick is being good boy as usual and Koda's loving the water. Happy. Yeah, I know you want to swim Happy. some more.
for wood ticks. Like, how gross is that? I woke up in the middle of the night last night, and like, ah, uh, it always happens this way for me. Like, here, like in Minnesota, at the lakes, there's tons of like wood ticks, and um, and generally, like, if you stay out of the like long grass, you're fine. But the dogs were snuggling me last night and I'm pretty sure, even though we put flea and tick stuff on them, pretty sure that one of the ticks made their way to me from them, even though they weren't in the long grass either. But went to the bathroom in the middle, middle of the night and like reached down and like on my thigh. It's like my worst fear, I don't know why, but I hate wood ticks. So like I reached down, of course something's crawling on my leg and I scream, I freak out and it's a wood tick. Ugh. And so, like, wood ticks are really hard to kill. You can't just, like, squish them to take your nail and, like, either, like, squish them in half or, like, burn them. It sounds so gross, but that's what you have to do to kill a tick. But I, I killed it, and I flushed it down the toilet. Yuck. Um, I haven't found any more on me, but since finding that one, I just feel like I'm crawling with wood ticks now. But anyways okay so that little story time is over right now we are at um, Walmart we're picking up some formula for Riker and like a couple of like miscellaneous things um, yeah so we spent um, a couple hours like a few hours in Park Rapids Minnesota um, which is close to where our lake cabin is where my grandparents lake cabin is um, picked up a few things um, from like the cute little shops downtown I got a cute kimono um, super sweet um, it's like a really pretty blush color I'll show you guys once I put it on um, yeah so went on a nice jog last night jumped in the lake afterwards and I think like right now it's raining so we picked a good day to come into town and have pizza and go to the candy shops and things like that um, because yeah like I said it's raining it's not very nice outside but hopefully it'll clear up this afternoon and we'll be able to go back into the lake probably go for another run this evening and jump in the lake after that again and just relax it's been really nice and the kids have been really good Poor Kaya is like covered in mosquito bites though. So we're picking up some children's um, Benadryl for her um, to try and get some of the swelling down just cause she reacts like so badly to mosquito bites. So we gotta get her, get her a little something for that. But anyways, all right. I hope you guys had an awesome 4th of July. I hope you had lots of fun with your family and your friends or whoever you decided to celebrate it with yourselves. Anyways, happy belated 4th of July. And I think we're gonna enjoy the rest of our evening. Oh, is my like heat seater on? Feels like it. <laughs> Anyways, all right. Hi, 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 reel it in, reel it in, reel it in, reel it in. Yeah, they're pokey. Bring here. A feisty one. Yeah, yeah, let's put it over there. Okay. Maybe this one's small enough for you to hold. You wanna try yes, hold it? Yeah. Yes. Wanna try to hold it? Yes. Yes. Alright. That's what you gotta do. Alright, that's what you gotta do. Morgan. Huh. Oh, is that a crawfish? No. Or is that a little baby bass? Or oh, is that sorry, sunny? Sorry. I can only see the top of it. <laughs> Oh, there we go. <laughs> you wanna touch the you wanna, don't touch the pokies. Okay. So we gotta put them in the soon, so you gotta no, hold, you gotta hold it. Chair. Stop. You gotta go like this. No, no. I have a shirt nope. on. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, no. This will have a broken mouth. Okay.
peanut butter is palatable. <laughs> peanut butter is palatable? <laughs> what? Peanut butter is palatable. That's a hard one. Okay, hot thing. Eat. Here's a Five foods. They don't have five foods. <laughs> so yeah, anyways, we are going to end the night with a little bit of a fire and playing some games and it's just quiet and it's so nice. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this crazy vlog so far. I think it's going to be a really long one. Yeah, are you listening to me talk to our friends? Yeah, are you listening to me? Yeah, he's a big boy. <laughs> So anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying this so far, but um, yeah, yeah. Should we go down to the lake and show them the lake? Yeah? Should we? Let's do it. Let's do it. Should we go down and see what's up? My hair is crazy. <laughs> what do you think? Think it's maybe time for bed, huh? Think it's time for bed? I do. I think it's time for bed. Yeah. All right, you guys. Well, I am going to end the vlog there for today. Um, I hope you enjoyed this really insane all over the place 4th of July vlog, our camping vlog. Um, welcome to life in Minnesota at the lakes in the summertime. I really hope you guys enjoyed the footage that I got. Thank you so much for tuning into today's video. I'm sorry I took a week off. I needed like an unplugged vacation. I just totally unplugged for the week and it was amazing and I had so much fun with my family and yeah. Be sure that you guys are subscribed to my channel before you leave and I will see you guys on Thursday for another really fun video. Okay, bye guys.